Hey guys, Nick here, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Scarlet, the final season. And today, guys, I mess with wires, IRL. There we go. So, off camera, I have been here in uh, the terrarium. Uh, and what have I been doing here? Getting BP for... Uh, getting starters around here because you apparently need to do that in order to get 200 Pokemon in the deck. Hey, look, look at that. I got some BP. Nice. Um. Ooh. Ooh, I didn't catch one of these. I love Poplio. Actually, Poplio was the first Pokemon I ever beat a Pokemon game with. Yeah. I don't have any quick balls anymore. I used them all. Come on, work. Dang it. Uh, okay, that's fine. Uh, all right, Cerule Edge. Come on. I might add one of these starter Pokemon to my team. I don't know for sure, though. I mean, I could just grab, like... How strong is the Growlithe that uh, Perrin gave me? I'll check in a second, but... Okay, there we go. It's almost down. Not quite. That doesn't affect us. Duskball. Cool, got it. All right. Okay, so uh, with Poplio registered, uh, that is 131 Pokemon in here. Uh, are there more that I need? Yes, there are. Holy crap, why is the water so laggy? I heard a thing about talking trash about Pal World, and I'm like, okay, at least Pal World works. Anyway, uh, wrong button. Here we go. Uh, yeah, I'm at 131 Pokemon in the Blueberry decks. I have a good amount of it done. I just need to get a couple more. Mostly evolutions, honestly. Um, but that's not what we're here for. You guys don't want to see me do this. Because that's boring. Instead, we are headed back to Paldea. And I want to take on something... Who do I still need to battle? Uh, Larry. I need to fight Larry. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I caught a man bug. Alright, hang on a sec. Um, where's that Growlithe that Perrin gave me? Here it is. Yeah, I'm not using that. Level 15 is way too low level for me. Like, I'd love to use it, but nah. Okay, so if I were to use one of the starters, I'd have to use a fire type. Um, yeah, I'd rather not. Yeah, let's stick with Lucario. I can't. I, I just can't. Hi, Pyroar. Um, yeah, I expanded the decks over here, and I do need to go over to the canyon biome, so let's, let's catch some Pokemon here, why not?
Um. Ah, it's been a while since I've played this. It's been a while since I've recorded it all. I have not had a day where I could just record for a bit. Hence, I actually am doing this like the day before I run out of stuff. So yeah, that was uh, that was close. Also, if you guys are wondering, I still have no idea how the DLC interacts with um, with just a regular playthrough. So yeah. <laughs> Gotta love the funky Driftdale City music. Um. Yeah, the thing is, when you've caught 200 Pokemon in an area, you kind of don't really know what you're looking for anymore. Alright, let's fly over the water. I'm just not seeing anything good. I'd love to get Ryan in on one of these episodes and just get some DP with him. Like, I feel like that would be pretty fun. Um... Head more inland. Um, I've caught like everything that's just easy to catch. There's 70 Pokemon left too. Ooh, I've caught. Yeah, I have a Talon Flame. I used one. Um. Uh, hmm. Come on. Where is... Where are all the starters? Like, I, I did that for this region, and there's just nothing here. Um, come on. Oh, Bulbasaur, a fan favorite. Then there's Cody. A real fan favorite. I have given false swipe to Ogre Pond and Cerulite, so I should really be leading with them. Uh, here we go. I'm getting a little bit slowed down by the fact that I've been focusing so much on BP. I think cleanly focusing on just getting Pokemon is probably going to serve me quite well. What's that even do? How is that bad? Genuinely, how is that bad? Like, insomnia stops me from going to sleep. And against Bulbasaur, that's even better. Like, because it can learn sleep powder. 
Yeah, I don't see how that's a bad thing. All right. Oh, hi. I think I caught a Jupiter. Yeah. I almost ca called it Dupiter. Yeah. And if that happened, I, I would have been like, I have become everything that I've stood against for eons. Um... Come on, come on. Have I caught an Alola Mola? I have. Come on. Get out of the water. There we go. What's my auto save on? Why do I have that off? I think it's something to do with when Ryan was having me shiny hunt with him. Which, by the way, not a fan of shiny hunting. Not a fan. I haven't caught a Grand Bull. That's interesting. Alright, here we go. A normal Terra type. Cool. Let's Stellar Terra with the Psychic move. Boom. Look at that. Psychic. Shabam. All right. And now, Dusk Ball. I love Stellar Terra. Like, it's just so cool. Something about it. I don't know. It's just cool. I like it. Anyway. Grand Bull's been caught. Cool. Uh, let me switch up my team. Ogre Pond, you're up front. Uh, I've caught Hapini. Um... Oh! Hello, Gothitelle. I need one of you. Oh, shoot. My bad. That was a misclick. Uh, why does the water look weird? Eh. Uh, just led me back outside. Do you think that Gothitel will respawn? Ooh, Mudkip. Hello. I love Mudkip. Alright, full swipe. Hmm. 
I'm not gonna use any of the Pokemon I catch, but like, you know. All right, got it. Okay. I know I hit up the entire Savannah biome practically. Um, so I think the coastal snowy um, What are the other biomes? Uh, yeah. uh, in Canyon biomes are the ones I need to hit up next. Yeah, I've got one. All right. Hello, Gothel. All right. False swipe. That did a lot less than I was hoping. All right. Come on. Come on. False swipe. that do again? I forget. Um, what? Um, oh, held item effects. Okay. Alright. Dusk Ball. Now I just need to catch... Gothi t uh, Gothi tells pre evolutions. Okay. Oh, my God, what the heck? Um, yeah, let's leave. I think we found everything we can in there. All right, up we go. Um, yeah, keep going up. I see an item. All right. Ooh, camera up. I don't think I've caught one. I have not. All right. Uh, false swipe. Ooh. Okay, no more false swiping. Ultra Ball. In like 15 minutes, I'll uh, I'll go get uh, some more badges and stuff. Not badges. Um, I'll uh, do some gym battles. Alright, up we go. Uh, I've not got a Nummel? Really? Okay, let's catch this thing. Pulse spike. Nice. All right, let's save Ultra Balls and catch it with a Great Ball. Cool. All right, caught the Nummel. Uh, now... Let's 
see. I also think I need to go back to Charge Stone Cave for like one Pokemon. Have I got a Bruxish? I have. Oops. All right, up I go. Uh, I don't see any other Pokemon. Ugh. I will say falling feels immersive. It's not the thing you want to feel immersive in a video game. Ooh, Chikorita. There are real defenders of the Chikorita line, and it's like, I like Bayleaf. I don't like Meganium, but I like Bayleaf. Chikorita is adorable. Uh, however, it is really weak. Which is kind of unfortunate because it is, it is adorable. And, uh, it is like, it is a good Pokemon line. Kind of sad that it's just so bad. Like, you straight up cannot use them. All right. Let's see. Ooh, I can get some rewards. Uh, is it for this? No. Oh, it's for that. Okay. Uh, let's keep looking around. Um, all right, polar biome. Uh, I have Golit. I forgot a certain Pokemon. Oh, hang on. I needed you. Oh, that's going to take a lot more. Never mind. Yeah, I went and grabbed the false swipe TM because I just felt it would be useful. All right, choose next Pokemon. Cerula, you're up. The Cerulean Edge Pokemon. It's got cool sword hands. Boom. Oh, Crabominable. Crabominable. I don't know how to say names, okay? Shut up. Uh, the, anyway, as I was saying before I saw this, I think I forgot a certain special Pokemon in the Coastal Biome. Um, I don't have a dugong. I'll catch this. It's a fairy type. Aw. Okay, what do I have that's good against fairy? I have Vicario. Like, if I just 
don't terrestrialize Lucario, I think I'll be fine. Because Lucario will terrestrialize into a fighting type. Alright, Aqua Tail, that's fine. Meteor Mash. Boom. All right, Ultra Ball. Caught it. All right. And I thought this would be challenging. Um. Do I have enough bombs now? I do not. Cool. Cool thing to find every now and again. Yeah, because it's already snowing. Dummy. Uh, I'm gonna shadow claw this. Yeah, look at that. Bruh. <laughs> that actually really sucks. All right, Ultra Ball. Cool, I caught it. I got it. All right. Um. Uh, anyway, as I was saying, I think I forgot a special Pokemon here, and I did not. I realize now that was wrong. My mistake. I shall explore the polar biome for a little bit. Um... I'm looking for things that I did not catch yet. Um, like this Beldum. Wait a minute. Okay, good. That's a quad resistance. Why do you know tackle? Didn't it used to only know takedown? Like, why is it? Why does it know tackle now? Why did that change? something. Plus a great ball. Dang it. Yeah, for some reason, Beldum has a catch rate of three. Right? I think it's one of the only non-legendary Pokemon to have Whoops. one of the only non-legendary Pokemon to have such a terrible catch rate. Um, wait, this was a mistake. The heck is wrong with me? Because now I'm no longer immune to tackle. Um, 
Yeah, catch rate of three. That is the same as legendary Pokemon. Which, if you think that's stupid, you are correct. A Snover! No, do not fight it. Then afterwards, I can go catch a Snover. It's not even shaking. Like, dude. Dude. Um. I can't even inflict the status condition. Like, dude. This sucks. Thank you. All right, Snover, you're next. All right, Beldum has been registered to the decks. 209 pounds. That seems like a lot for such a small thing. All right, Beldum. Or Snover. My sorry. Oh, sorry. I can't talk today, can I? That's fine. Sheer cold. Oh, yeah. That's right. I'm a higher level. Still, I didn't know Snover could actually get sheer cold. Please don't freeze. Okay. Please freeze. Please freeze. Please freeze. Hang on, I can do that better. <coughs> Need some water. Please freeze, please freeze, please freeze. Oh, uh, yeah. Please freeze. Alright. Yeah, I know I said I'd go do gym battles, but I'm actually... Perfectly content doing this for once. Hey, I got a rare candy. The heck is that? Oh, it's like a little pavilion type thing. I don't think I used that word right, pavilion. Hi. I have one of you. I also have one of you. Um, so, my excitement is gone. Um, yeah, let's go into Charge Cone Cavern for a minute. I need to go catch a Drillbur. Because apparently I didn't do that already. Um, All right. I think this is the only Pokemon in Charge Stone Cavern that I haven't caught yet. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Wait, they're just ground types. Okay, I know there's a Pokemon Center down here somewhere. I'm going to make my way over to that. What would happen if I hit this? <laughs> okay. No electrocution, no nothing. That's kind of weird, but whatever. All right. I think I'm in the canyon biome suddenly. Well, you know what? I wanted to check this place out anyway. In the sky? What? I know what it meant, but seriously? <laughs> Alright. A Golurk. Perfect.
Um, now Golurk. I'll have to Psycho Cut. Vanished instantly. Switch to Terrapagos. Watch this. I love the, uh, I love Tropagos. I think it's adorable. Just a little turtle, you know? All right. Dang it. Okay, so we outspeed, despite the fact that we are a literal turtle. Why did it, Phantom Force? Oh, crit capture. Let's go. All right. Um... Yeah, we're going to head up to the top of this mountain. Actually, I see a nice little cave over here. Also, unrelated question, why on earth is Metagross always found in, like, snowy areas? Okay, always is a strong word, but, like... It's happened several times. Like, Metagross... I think that's the top mountains. Also, keep in mind, I am not currently looking for a Metagross. That was an unrelated question. I, I just want to know, like, why is it whenever I go to a mountain, I always see a Metagross or someone in its uh, evolution line? Oops. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I didn't mean to run into you. I'm out. The heck? like a secret area. Um. Okay, maybe not too secret. It's, it is just behind the gym. Um, let's head to the Pokemon Center next to it, or the Poke -Heal Healer, Poke Healer thing. All right, this was probably my favorite um, Elite Four member to fight, uh, Drayton. I won't lie, he probably was. I just had fun with fighting him.
All right, I see a nice little cave over here, and then we're going to head over to the... Actually, mm. I have an Axio. It's like the items. Didn't mean to get into a fight with ya. All right. Um. Oh, hello. I think we're like the last Pokemon I need to get here. Is that starters? Um. Like, Bear Ticks at Tarpon Starters. It's putting itself to sleep. This is amazing. I just found a uh, thought of a Pokemon I could probably find pretty easily in the coastal biome. Um, anyway. Yeah, I think I do need to get Ryan and trade a bunch of Pokemon at some point. All right, this way. Let's head up to that peak. Okay. There's like one more Pokemon I need in the coastal biome, and then a bunch I need in the canyon biome. Um, but since we've been going for a while, I might... No, we're gonna keep... We're gonna keep catching. I'll, I'll keep catching some more Pokemon. Hang on. Let me just... Check. Who do I need still? Ooh, real quick. Um. Alright, who's the next Pokemon that I need to catch? That is a surprise. Lives in caves rarely... Rarely seen. Okay, okay. Um, next. Canyon biome, rarely seen. 
I might have to expand dexes for that. Whimsicott. Kosobam. Okay. Also coast No. Habitat unknown. All right. Habitat also unknown. I thought I had a lantern. Okay. Um, all right. Skarmory is next, I guess. Come on. Need to fly. Okay, often search around this area. What about in these grasslands? Or in this cave, maybe? There oh, there's just an item. Um... Come on, come on. I think I've explored all of this before. Let's check out somewhere else. Oh, that's the edge of the map. on top. I'll fight a hit on top. I'm probably not going to keep catching Pokemon too much longer. Ice Terra. Interesting. Uh, let's U-turn. Okay, that did a bit of its health on its own. Alright, Lucario. Did it predict that? What the heck? Not even kidding. I expected a, it to outspeed Lucario for a moment there. All right, Aura Sphere. Cool. All right. Come on. Figured there would be an item over here across the parkour that you just don't have to do.
We've been going for almost an hour. And I'm getting kind of sick of this. How much more... How many more Pokemon do I need to grab? Um... Oh, hello. I think in that cave is a Rhydon. I can't be sure. I'll check that out. Um. Great ball. All right, caught the lantern. All right. I think this is a ride on. Yep. Um, if you're wondering how a Rhydon got in the middle of a pool of water, uh, it used to be able to learn Surf. Also, it has a Water Terra. Uh, yeah, how many Pokemon do I need to catch still? Almost 50. Yeah, we made almost no progress in an hour. However, I really needed to record this video and um, fill it with something. It is very hard to make Pokedex completion interesting. It's just nothing happens. Um, yeah, we're back at the Savannah biome again. All right, well, it's raining. Let's head back to Paldea. So, who are we going to fight? Uh, we, did we fight, uh, them? I think we did. I think I had my rematch against him. I'll have to see. All right. Uh, anyway, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. Where is the... There it is. I think I fought him in the last episode, but it's... Once again, it's been a while. All right. We run fast. Um, yes. I think I battled you in the last video, but let's do this again. Oops. I don't think I'm... Ow. Sorry, I hurt myself there. I don't think I'm quite ready to take on... This, we did this last time. But yeah, my bad. 
All right. Let's you turn. Take this. Uh, and then let's go into Lucario, because why not? Can we real quick talk about how Armor Rouge and Cerule Edge, it, the choice of which one you would use if you had a choice between them, it wouldn't really matter. Because Ogre Pond and Cerule Edge have practically like the same weaknesses and base stats. And even if their base stats like were extremely different, it doesn't matter that their moves. Like, the parts of their base sets that are different, their moves make up for that. Honchkrow, yeah, let's switch to... Tropagos. Alright. Oops. A little turtle becomes... A, a, a disc, basically. Terra Starstorm. Alright. King Gambit. Alright, back to Lucario. Ryan told me that on his new playthrough of this game, he's using a Go-Go a Dracapult, a Garchomp, and a Dragonite. And I'm like, oh my god. Holy ice weakness. Like, cool Pokemon. Definitely cool Pokemon. You have... However, your team has a nine times weakness to ice. And then he told me that his other two Pokemon were Colossal and... Um, I forgot who else, but it was like a colossal, and I was like, okay, that almost makes up for that. However, now you have pretty big weakness to water, so if you're up against a water, uh, a water ice type, you're screwed. So, yeah, Ryan, Ryan you just got a tight balance, dude. Type balance. Also, three dragon types. They're all pseudos, but they're th it's three dragon types. Um. Anyway, let's go and take on not you. Stick on this star base or star leader. Uh, and then we can do... Uh, actually, this video's been going on for a while. I'll do this, and then I'll probably, like, do a gym, some gym battles in the next episode. <sighs> also, off-camera, I'll actually focus on completing my decks. Yeah, um, make sure if you, it, when doing Pokemon playthroughs, make sure that your team actually will work well. Alright, I need to find the garage. There it is. Alright. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There we go. Now I'm ready. Now I'm ready to fight you. Okay, let's do this. Atticus. I forgot his name for a moment. Really? The first poison, t poison type he starts with is dark? Alright. 
Uh, Tropagos, you're up. All right. Uh, if anyone knows a good way for me to collect battle points or blueberry points, uh, that would be very helpful if you could, uh, could help me with that. It's not very effective, buddy. Sorry. Beat that, Atticus. All right. Muck. Okay. Meow stick. All right, there goes Muck. All right, Rev of Room. I'll switch to Cerule Edge for this. A Steel type versus a Poison type, you know, like that. That that works. Also, the next Pokemon game to come out, I'm definitely using more Pokemon of the region that they're from. Because I've used, like, a total of six, maybe eight, on the three teams I've used. And that's just not enough. Oh, I made a mistake. Wait, no, I didn't. I know Psycho Cut. Did I just inadvertently poison myself? How does Baneful Bunker work? I don't know. Oh, that still didn't KO it. Wow. This Toxapex might actually give me some trouble. I should switch. <sighs> Come on. Okay, we defeated Toxic Attack. All right, Dragalge. Meow stick, you're up. Let's do this. Okay, I did not rip my mic right out of my computer. <laughs> Nearly made a mistake. Alright, Dragalge. Perish. Watch this! Psychic. All right, there goes Dragalge. Team Star defeated again. Also, once again, designs. Designs of the care of like the side characters in this game were very good. And then I have the just the protagonist design and you it's like you can't switch your outfit and it, it's disappointing. Uh but either way guys, that's gonna end this video here. If you enjoyed it, remember to like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications, share this video with everyone you know and love, and I'll see you all later. Bye!